In this video, I'm going to be quickly listing the definitions of every enthalpy change that you will need to know. For a more in-depth explanation of everything, check out my other enthalpy change video. I'll have a link in the description below. First of all, a standard enthalpy change is an enthalpy change that has been measured under standard conditions. If you're asked for the definition of the standard enthalpy change for something, you just have to add under standard conditions to the end of the definition. OK, let's jump into the definitions. The mean bond enthalpy is the average enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous covalent bonds is broken. The enthalpy of reaction is the enthalpy change that occurs when equation quantities of reactants react with each other. The enthalpy of formation is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a compound is formed from its constituent elements in their standard states. The enthalpy of combustion is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a substance is burnt completely in oxygen. The enthalpy of neutralization is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of water is formed from a reaction between an acid and an alkali. The first ionization energy is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous atoms each loses one electron to form one mole of gaseous ions, each with a one plus charge. The second ionization energy is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous ions with a one plus charge each loses one electron to form one mole of gaseous ions, each with a two plus charge. The first electron affinity is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous atoms each gains an electron to form one mole of gaseous ions, each with a one minus charge. The second electron affinity is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous ions with a one minus charge each gains an electron to form one mole of gaseous ions, each with a two minus charge. The enthalpy of fusion is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a solid melts to form a liquid. The enthalpy of vaporization is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a liquid vaporizes to form a gas. The enthalpy of sublimation is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a solid sublimes to form a gas. The enthalpy of transition is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a substance changes its state. The enthalpy of solution is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a solute dissolves in water to give an infinitely dilute solution. The enthalpy of hydration, more commonly known as the hydration enthalpy, is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous ions dissolves in water to give an infinitely dilute solution. The enthalpy of atomization is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of gaseous atoms is formed from a substance in its standard state. The lattice formation enthalpy is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a solid ionic lattice is formed from its constituent ions in the gas phase. The lattice dissociation enthalpy is the enthalpy change that occurs when one mole of a solid ionic lattice is broken down into its constituent ions in the gas phase. And that's everything. Make sure to check out my other enthalpy change video if you'd like a more in-depth explanation about all of this. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing and let me know in the comments if you have any questions.